behind me. There is nothing they will do to me. Not today, not tomorrow. That will make me to abandon Biafra is impossible. When we started to remember our heroes that have passed on, they said we are wasting our time, that we will never succeed, it will never catch on. But they keep forgetting one simple thing, that the foundations of IPOB was anchored on the promise of Chukukika Biyama. Yes. that this very noble family, this very great movement was not instigated nor started by any human being. It is the handiwork of Tuko Kikapiyama. And that is why we remain indestructible. That is why we remain indivisible. That is why nobody, no matter who you are, can dent our resolve and our determination to restore Biafra in this life. Man from the heavens, Man from the heavens. And you were now Basos your match in Eke. Okay, Zipazo. Will you be a no? Devo Mahi. If I knew Guany. Sabo. On your bed, you these are the people that the Fulanese gave to you to rule over you. They started it with Ohanese in 1976. Every leader you have had until the coming of IPOB, anybody who's ever stood up to proclaim the defense of our people, we are planted there by the Fulani North. But you wouldn't know. That is why when they close down Iguacha Seaport, they will not speak. That is why when they close Enugu Airport, you don't hear anybody saying anything. That is why Calabas Seaport is not functioning. That is why Wari Seaport is not opened. That is why we are being forced to travel abroad. That is why no industries are opened in our land. Because they have an agenda. They have a plan. They want to depopulate our land. They want to demoralize us. They want to decimate us. They want to render us hopeless and useless. God forbid. Ah, look, ah, look. Abomination forever. But IPOB said no. Chukwokika Biyama that set up IPOB said no. And that is why we must remain resolute and determined. That is why we must not falter. Yes. Doubt nor allow our resolve to be undermined. Yes. We must remain resolute. Yes. Yes. We must remain determined. Yes. Yes. Because one thing is certain as night follows day, so shall be after be restored. Yes. Yes. Therefore, I say unto all of you gathered here today that the forces fighting IPOB is many. Those that want us to fail are more powerful than we are. They are more resourceful than we are. They have more money than we do. And they are determined to keep us as their slaves. But it will never happen. Those chains of bondage and of slavery has been broken by IPOB. <laughs> That is why Biafra will come. And that is why the events happening here today in Atlanta, Georgia, United States of America, we will all sit back home to talk about it. We will all sit in the land of Biafra to talk about days like this. We shall sit in the land of Biafra to tell our children what will pass through. Because the doubting Thomases will come. Yes. Mm. Yes. 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 Yes.
They will never stop fighting us. And as long as we remain determined and focused, there is no way they will ever, ever succeed. Never. 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 If you stop now agitating for Biafra, those who left back home will die. I know you have not come with your pen and paper because I'm not on air. I want you to write it down on a piece of paper. If you stop what you're doing, our people will die. Yes. You're right. Because when it starts happening, I will tell you on the 30th of May 2019 at Martin Luther King Jr. Center in Atlanta, I told you so. Wow. Yes. Spirit in human If you stop now, your children will never go home. God forbid. God forbid. If you stop now, the effort and the sacrifice of our dead will be in vain. For their sake, we will restore Biafra. Yes. For their sake, Biafra will stand in Africa. Yes. For the sake of the dead, we will build a civilization to surpass every other civilization in Africa. Yes. And that is what our enemies are afraid of. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Especially the British. Because they don't want a black man to do that thing that is the exclusive preserve of the white man. But we are not afraid of competition, are we? Never. Never. We are not seeking for Biafra that we may lord it over anybody else. No. We are not seeking for Biafra to enslave any other person. No. We are not looking for Biafra Never. for the sake of it. No. We are looking for Biafra because it is the promise of God himself in heaven. Truth is life. That's where you Nobody conquered us until the British came. Yes. And it's, it is not that the British conquered Biafra. Never. Chukwoki Biama wanted to teach us a lesson. Mm. Uh -huh. That we may return to him. Yes. yes. In truth and in every honesty. Yes. That his will may be done upon our lives. Yes. Yes. We failed in 1970. Because that very foundation of divinity was missing. Yes. That's all. And Elohim said, I will take you up to the mountain. I will show you that very precious land of Biafra. Through our leader that we remember today, the very people's general himself, that wherever, because we are certain that he is in heaven, yes. Yes. on the right hand side of God himself, some of you don't know what he did but we know and we will always honor him always. forever as they say what we do in life echo in history what Ojuku has accomplished in life will be remembered forever and ever I say unto all of you today you will go back to your various states, to your various cities, to your various towns. You will tell them that IPOB has come to stay. That IPOB, by the grace of God in heaven, will restore Biafra. That this same IPOB persecuted and maligned, castigated and propagated against. That this very movement ordained in heaven for the purposes of liberation of Biafra land shall accomplish its mandate. That is why you are all here. Nothing more, nothing less. Therefore, I ask the Almighty in heaven. Because you have no beginning and you have no end. Mm. Mm. 
Onye ndi mwozi na kwisi alanye. Abula di njo kenyo oru abu ona no. Na tumbo le donase ne de nso chineke. Na nso ka jihova de. Therefore, this very solemn assembly to remember those that fought and died for us all over the world, starting from Japan in the east, and will end in Los Angeles, California, later on today, that their spirit, O oh Heavenly Father, may be accepted unto heaven, because they died fighting for a noble cause, they died doing that which you compelled them to do. And because of their sacrifice, because of their pain, because of our loss upon our, their lives, O oh Heavenly Father, so will be Afro be restored, not to the glory of man, but to the glory of Chukwakikabiyamabiniwe. Forever and ever we pray. Yes. IPOB. IPOB. I be a be one family.